quiet, Vito. Since when are you concerned about making noise? There's too many of them. Just take them out nice and quiet. For what? Sit and be quiet. the last of them. See? Ain't so bad so far, right? Yeah, but what if somebody recognizes us and calls us about it? That's why we ain't leaving no witnesses. There's probably more of them down here. Get ready. You're dead, you slanty-eyed fuck! What is it that you want? What the fuck do you think we want? We want to know why you had our friend killed. We also want the money you took from him. I had no choice. Your friend was a government informer. What the what? fuck are you talking about? A contact inside the Federal Bureau of Narcotics told me that Henry Tomasino passed them information about our deal. That's a fucking lie! Whoa, whoa, whoa. You saying Henry was a rat? Yes. But not anymore. That's bullshit. Makes no sense. And I suppose you had nothing to do with the little stick-up after we closed the deal with you either, right? You think we would take such a stupid risk and destroy our own factory? That was just another reason to get rid of you. We had problems with you from the very beginning. Yeah. Well, all your problems are just about over, pal. So where's our money? It's not here anymore. What? Where the hell is it then? I cannot tell you. If you don't tell us, I'm gonna splatter your yellow brains all over this fucking room. If I told you, I'd be dead anyway. Fine, your choice. Are you crazy? What you wanna do, let him go or something? We could've gotten more out of him. Fuck that, he wouldn't have said nothing. These bastards are tough. Let's just get the hell out of here before the cops come. Looks like 
This place won't be open enough for a while. If we had the time, I'd burn it to the damn ground. Vito, come here. Ah, oh, fuck this! Come on, Vito! This guy's a maniac! We gotta Let's take him down! Him. Find us a car, quick! Roger that. Take me to my place, Vito. I need a fucking drink. That was, uh... was fucked up, huh? Yeah. I don't want to talk about it. Just get me back to my place, would you? All right. deal was a total fucking disaster. Tell me about it. Henry's dead. We don't have Bruno's money. We killed half the Tongs. And if they think Carlo sent us, it'll mean war. Psh, we're fucked. Yeah. And if Carlo finds out we got him into this mess... What if Henry really was a rat? No fucking way. Don't even say that. Look, first let's get the money for Bruno. That'll fix at least one problem. But I'm done for today. I need a drink. I'll call you in the morning. We'll figure this shit out. All right. Okay, I'll see you later. And Vito, be careful. Sound like I'm ready. You just woke me up. So get the fuck up. We don't get the money for Bruno today. We're fucked. Where the hell are we gonna get our hands on 55 grand, huh? I don't know. We sure as hell ain't gonna find it laying around in bed. I got something for starters. A job from Eddie with a big payout. No shit? Yeah, I'll pick you up in a few minutes. So get dressed, grab a gun, and wait for me outside. I'll tell you more in the car. This better not be one of your brilliant ideas, Joe. Hey, I'm not in the mood. Sorry, sorry. Didn't mean to snap at you. I'm still half asleep over here. Yeah, yeah, whatever. So you in or not? Sure, why not? How long till you get here? I'm calling from the gun shop around the corner. I'll be at your place in a minute. All right, I'll wait for you out back. I'll see you soon. Hey, 
Hey, what's with the fancy wheels? Eddie gave it to us just for this job. Nice, eh? You drive. My head's still pounding from last night. We're going to Greenfield. Guess you hit the sauce pretty hard, too, huh? Yeah, I couldn't sleep either. Nothing a bottle of scotch couldn't fix, though. Head over to Greenfield. Just gonna drive there, pop some guy, and drive away. Should be a piece of cake. Why? Eddie said it's a favor for some family from another city. Unfinished business. He gave me this envelope with all the instructions. He said it's gotta be clean, and it's gotta be done today. Why the hell doesn't the other family just do it themselves? Eddie said they've been looking for this guy for a while, and he just found him. They're afraid that if it ain't done right away, the guy's gonna disappear again. Here, here's a picture. What'd this guy do? Says here he ratted his family out to the feds. The guy's got to come with oh. Wait. If he cooperated with the feds, that means he was under protection, right? What if he still is? We've been here for years. We're getting paid a few grand for the job. So it's more than worth the risk. I hope you say so. Hey, we need every penny we can get right now, right? So after we finish this job, we'll split up and look for other one. All right. Says here they want us to give him a message before we do it. Yeah, here it is. Okay, got it. Hey, if you see Eddie later, not a word about yesterday. He was never there. The last chink we saw was delivering egg full young. You get it? Yeah, who do you think I am? Some kind of retard? Jury's still out on that one, pal. Just making sure you don't slip up, that's all. Gotta say? Yeah. All right. Here we go then. Mr. Angelo. I. Uh, Yes? Mr. Salieri sends his regards. Like I said, my sister called Dark Hair, medium hair. Those guys are. Oh shit! No! no. We got a homicide here. Suspect is armed. This is Agent Cox. Ten four. Police support in Greenfield. Up and down. Up and down. Shoot this asshole. Roger that. Those were feds. That is.